I would say in Cardiff, we try and get students to be as active as possible in their learning. So it's not just about sitting in lectures, although that's still a very important part of our teaching. It's about getting hands-on activities. So problems, solving problems, testing things, building things. So it's a lot more than just being in a lecture and, and think that you're learning technical skills. It's actually all the other things that make you really a, a true engineer, I think. Universities invested a lot recently in the facilities in terms of lecturing, uh, but also we have good uh, laboratories. Uh, the laboratories themselves are slightly different from other universities. We haven't gone towards pushing those as labs for teaching. We really put them back into the research areas, which are the interesting places to be working in. So while you're doing your labs, you're going to find that you've actually got other people around you doing other research. So it's, it, it, it's much more exciting, I think, for students to be in this environment. We're also trying to do more problem-based learning. So we have new rooms developed here, which encourage people to work together in groups, not just on a particular degree, but between degree schemes. So that really engenders then a, a, a much more active and interesting, we think, learning environment. Our students are really ready for employment, not only at the end of their degree, but our students go out, many of them go on year in industry. And what our employers tell us, even after having only two years here, that the skills, the knowledge, and more importantly, their approach to engineering and to the employer is, is really good. And so I think it's not just about employability and having some skills about CV writing and covering letters and actually being able to engage with employers, but actually by the way in which we teach them and the way in which we encourage them to think as engineers and become engineers, they become ready. And I think that's something, a trait that we're quite proud of here.